you have heard people say that you can't change your past, but you can change your future. But uh, today I will tell you that you can change your future and you can also change your past. But first we have to define what past is. We're going to define past and I will try to show you how you can go back and change your past. So sometimes people think that uh, past is uh, something that happened to them, an event that happened to them, or maybe something that they did, or maybe it's even uh, somebody who they were at one point in their life. The most accurate definition of past that I have found is how I look at it. How do I look at my past? How do I look at that event that happened in my life? Or maybe something that I did, or maybe the, the person that I was at one point in my life. The most interesting thing about past is that you can change it. And uh, a lot of people think that you can't do anything about your past, you have to move on. Yes, that is part of it. Moving on is part of changing your past. And people sometimes think you can't change your past, but I will try to explain my theory of how you can go back and change your past. An example I'm going to bring is something that happened to me when I was younger. I think I was like seven years old and uh, I was riding a scooter and uh, I, I think I either hit a rock or, or, or a pothole in the, in the concrete and uh, I flipped over and hit my nose on the concrete and it started bleeding. And uh, I, for a while, when I looked back at that event, I looked at it as a really bad thing something that happened to me, unpleasant, I didn't like it, I didn't want it. But now when I look at it, I laugh at it because it's just my past. And in this example, I'm gonna show that your past changes with time just because how you look back at it. So at one point I was looking back at that event and I was sad, but now when I look at it, it doesn't really matter and I actually laugh. It's interesting to see what God thinks about our past and uh, God says that uh, once you repent and I forgive you, I forget. I forget all the things that you did. I forget all the, all the sins that you have committed. He says, I forget him. I just throw everything over my shoulder. And uh, now I define you as my child, as my son or my daughter. And we're going to keep moving forward. We're not living in your past. We're not thinking about your past. We're moving forward because you're a new creation. You're a new human being. You have been born again. And uh, just by, by these examples, uh, I want to encourage everybody to don't look at your past as a bad thing, but look at your past and move forward in life and stay encouraged.